don't feel guilty making sacrifices or going after what you want based on what other people think. I'm Bochi and I'm a junior vehicle dynamics engineer at MoneyGram Haas at Monty. My job mainly focuses on the modeling of the vehicle model. So what I do is I take, for instance, a suspension model and put that into software and code uh, to then be used as a model to set up the car for pre-event and during the race. I think from a quite young age, like I used to always build things with my brother. So it was me and my brother at home trying to use Lego, trying to use Duplo and things like that to build things. And then in high school, I, I liked physics and chemistry and maths the most. It's always what attracted me. I, I like logic and the nice thing of engineering and of physics. It's just that it's true or it's not true. And there's kind of a binary state in it, which I enjoy. My school was slightly different than how it is in the UK. Uh, so I studied in the Netherlands, my high school, and we do focus on a certain profile. So I did uh, more physics profile and more chemistry profile, but for the rest we study 16 subjects, so it's, it's very broad. So I did a bachelor's in applied physics, uh, then I did a master's in aerospace and a master's in motorsport engineering. Studying, I wouldn't say. What I found always really interesting in studying is that whenever I told someone that I was studying applied physics, I never initially thought of it, but everyone's response was like, oh, that must be interesting being a woman uh, studying this. And it was never something I thought of myself before, but just because everyone starts to question and be like, but how is it to be a minority? How, how is it? You start to be like, oh, but is it different? Is it weird? So it's not necessarily criticism, but it's just something that I wouldn't have thought of myself, but just because of the world viewing it in that way, I start to also question it in a point. It was really during my master's in aerospace engineering. Uh, I always liked F1, especially during my studies in Delft. It was it was very big thing in the Netherlands. Max Verstappen just joined, which I think helped as well. Um, but studying aerospace and realizing like the aerodynamics that's going on in F1, I started to realize the engineering was behind it. Before that, I, I enjoyed it as a sport, but I never really knew the engineering that was in it. Um, so yeah, more understanding what was happening made me want to pursue a career into it. To me, it's on, on like the fast-paced world and the competition. Like I love competition. Uh, I love the engineering it, and and it's nice. Like because you want to do good, you're pushed to develop more. Uh, if you're just doing it to just do it, the development will stagnate at some point. So having the competition pushes everyone to their limits, which I really enjoy. There's a lot of people that help you along the way, but there's not one person that stands out. Um, there's a lot of people, even right now, in the team that help me on a day-to-day -day basis to learn. Uh, a lot of my teachers um, during university help me, but there's not one person that stands out, if I'm very honest. Go for what you want. Like a lot of people always tell you, oh, you should do this or you should do this. Like even if it's family, if it's friends or if it's anyone. But I think we all know what we want and don't feel guilty making sacrifices or going after what you want based on what other people think. Like you're entitled to your passion and your opinion. And I think as long as you enjoy doing what you do, you should go for it. In my opinion, what helped most in actually making your CV stand out is, for instance, everyone does do a Formula student. It's quite easy to get into and a lot of universities have it. So most people that apply will have Formula student on there. One thing that distinguishes more is doing actually lower categories because there's a lot less people. And in my opinion, you learn more because you have the really small team. You work super close with the mechanics and trying to do Formula 4, Formula 3, things like that. I think you will learn more and your CV will stand out more uh, if that's the way you want to go into it. So.